Hey guys, it's Big Anu and the new update is here so I wanted to show you guys quickly what these totems are all about. Some of the guys are discussing on Facebook and even on Castle Clash forums that totems are not that helpful but I beg differ actually because if you think about Heroes Trial and HBM, especially Heroes Trial and HBM, these two game modes, totems are going to be super nice. So what I have in my totems is right now I have a Valentina right there and in this other totem I have a Cupid. Both of them, you know what they do, they'll just... So let's take a look at the stats. So this Cupid buff is going to be like 35% increase of attack and 35 energy, energy 35. It's not great but it's okay. I mean, it's, it's a boost in energy and a boost in attack for 6 seconds which is more than enough to finish that hero trial same thing with Valentina she helps in increasing 70% so 70 energy is quite awesome but just it will allow me to finish one wave but the next wave in case of HB my heroes will be ready with about 70% uh, more energy or much more energy than ideally speaking so let me try and show you guys a hero trial right maybe a level 16 i can do 17 and 18 but i just wanted to show you the proc so there's cupid immediately everyone they all get that boost the attack boost and i just hope someone comes from this side and I get to show you guys okay so here he comes okay valentina procs my VLAD is full. Basically, the energy in VLAD is full. Yeah, that's it. So, look at that, guys. You, I can also put another PD if I, I do have another PD which I can put in one of these totems. So, you could use the same type of hero in one of the other totems as well, which is quite awesome. So, if I want to, I can put this destroyer who would basically have a 300% attack to the nearby guys. So, pretty much killing. <laughs> at least half of the wave and it also provides 30 uh, percent damage so one of the allied heroes basically gets an attack speed boost of 35 percent so imagine a vlad getting an attack speed boost or a skull knight getting that boost for five seconds it would be just awesome right so totems they are definitely useful in guild wars hbm and hero trials your hbm is going to be become a little bit more easier hbm t hbm aa onwards if you have not finished them yet so i am still stuck at the last wave of t4 t5 uh, especially t5 actually i'm hoping i'll probably make a video where i finish that t wave all right guys so to hire these totems you need to go to your defenses and just click on here if your town hall is level 16 you'll get one totem if you have town hall is level 2 at uh, level 20 you'll get two totems and right now i just upgraded them to level six all you need is just mana to upgrade your things and some more time so i purchased gems and just made it to six of six quickly so that i can show you guys in this video hopefully you enjoyed that and according to me the two good heroes for this is going to be valentine for me and cupid because they just fill my heroes with a lot of energy and that's what I want energy and um, hitting power. Alright, guys, hope you enjoyed that one. Have a great day. You could also put a good druid in there so that if you need some healing, extra healing, or put a tree and tar. Think about a tree and tar. He will, if your PD has al is already dead, try to put your totem right at the center of your base. And if one or two of your heroes are dead, they will actually come back because of tree and tar. So, there, there are so many possibilities that we can use for totems. Hopefully you enjoyed that. Take care guys.